What is going on guys? Welcome back. In this quick video today, I want to show you a Linux tool called QDIRSTAT, which visualizes your file system so that you can easily spot large files and you can easily see how your files are structured. So let us get right into it. All right, so this is going to be quite a short video today. I just want to show you this tool called QDRStat, which basically visualizes your file system. And this can be extremely useful when you try to clean up your system or when you try to see how the system is structured so that you can delete unnecessary files that are quite large. If you just want to see visually uh, what your file system looks like and where you have larger files, where you have a lot of small files, stuff like that. So what you want to do on Linux, at least on Debian based distributions, you just want to go ahead and use sudo app install qdirstat. And I think that there are going to be equivalent commands and packages for the different uh, Linux distributions. And once you have this tool installed, this is basically qdirstat stands for uh, Qt based directory statistics, I think. And there's also a tool for Windows called windirstat. So those of you who are watching this and you have Windows, if you are still watching the video, there's also a tool called windirstat, which is I think even a little bit more advanced. Uh, but what you can do basically is you can select either just a specific directory, a specific path, or you can just go with a full file system. And basically, this is going to now analyze everything, it's going to scan the whole file system. And once the scanning is done, you're going to get a nice graphical overview of the files of the directory structure. Um, and you're going to see immediately visually using colored squares, where you have quite large files and where you have medium sized or very small files. And as I said, this can be very useful when you're trying to uh, for example, clean up a lot of space and you don't know, okay, does it make sense to clean up very small files, a lot of very small files, or does it make more sense to delete this one big file that I don't need anymore? Uh, stuff like that. So what you can see here is uh, you can see the directory system. Now, if you're using Windirstat, it's looking a little bit better on QDIRSTAT. I think the uh, visualization isn't as good looking as on Windows, unfortunately. But what you can see here is every square represents a single file. So when I click on this here, this is Code Wars new to cut and MKV MOV. This is just a video that I've recorded here in a raw format, or actually, I think this is in a already converted format. Uh, you can see this is 30 gigabytes. So for example, if my my goal right, right now was to, um, to clean up my my file system, I would maybe delete this video because I don't need it anymore instead of going and you know, looking for smaller files here, for example. So just right clicking this and deleting saying here, no way to undelete uh, would be enough to get rid of this file. And then also this would be updated. And you can see when I click here, those are all videos. You can see also they have the same color because they have the same file type. Uh, and I also have some smaller videos here. Now this is also a large file. What is this? This is a data set that I have. Uh, what do we have here? This is some um, DaVinci Resolve Debian package. So for this operating system for Debian based distributions, uh, here we have some Thunderbird storage emails that I have somewhere. This is some uh, CUDA file here, some library file. And you know, you can just continue to go through the individual sections here. You can also use this view above here. So you can also um, scroll to a specific directory, for example, videos here, and you can see then that this red square here, this red selection is the video directory, and I can just scroll in and then I can limit my view to this uh, particular section here. So now I'm only looking at the video directory and what I have in there. Uh, those are just all the different videos that I have recorded here with some uh, yeah, with some notes, like what I need to censor. Sometimes I have API keys, sometimes I mess up uh, something while I'm speaking, I have to cut and censor certain things, I usually include that into the file name. But yeah, you can scroll out, you can scroll in somewhere else. And you can uh, just analyze your file system like that. And I, I think this is very convenient to visually see your file system. And this is a nice tool that I like to use whenever I need to clean up some space. So this is just something I wanted to show you guys today real quick. All right, so that's it for the short little video today. Let me know in the comment section down below if you enjoy videos like this. This was not really a tutorial. It was just me showing you a tool that I use on a regular basis, a nice Linux tool. Let me know if you enjoy videos like this. Let me also know by hitting a like button. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell to not miss a single future video for free. Other than that, thank you much for watching. See you in the next video and bye.